Right, so something to something different to start the week with. Well, basically, I've got these linear actuators. You'll notice there's two uh, two actuators there with a 20 centimeter throw. Uh, so basically, the thread is inside here and moves up 20 centimeters or very close to. Uh, this one's 40 centimeters, it's double. Um, that's those three are going to lift that section of bonnet. Up above, above here, basically, that's the plant. So if I come down here, I'll show you. I'll have to zoom out a little bit. Okay. Okay. So these two little ones, they're going to be at the back here somewhere mounted, which is what I'm working on today. Uh, they'll go up there, one up there, one up there. The 40 centimeter one, I've got to try and figure out how to mount that. Actually, I'm not entirely sure yet, but it's going to somehow sit in the middle of here, um, and then it'll basically lift the front. So the the, the back will lift like that. The frontal lift further up like that so it'd be like a sort of a an angled version pretty much so yeah we'll see how we go it will, might take longer than i expect but we'll see how it goes it's uh, something fun to play with so yeah i'll try and get it working and do the second part of the video asap right so we're a bit slower progress than expected however things are moving along quite nicely there's been more prep work than i expected um, so what I've been doing is, uh, so it's a bit dark unfortunately in here, but I was trying to show you. Um, I've basically been chopping back the the section there, which basically would have been for the, the tubes and stuff to go in for the heater matrix, which obviously there's no heaters there anyway anymore. Um, so I've chopped all that back, and then basically folded it all into, into sort of in on itself down here. I don't know if you can see, and that'll all be tied up nicely at the end there. Um, I've made the mounting bracket. For the uh, for the for the linear actuator itself, uh, I've obviously got that all in as well. That's all perfectly fine and nice and level. I've only got one in, uh, and the reason behind that is I can't fit two. Uh, what I've done there is one. I was going to put one here, one there, but I literally can't get the drilling over here. I can't put it. Uh, I was going to put on the, either on the strut here or on here, um, but I can't get it anywhere over here there's literally no room to get a drill in and do it properly um so basically what i decided to do i decided to go for a single one in the middle it's not quite in the middle but it's near enough uh it won't matter anyway it won't make much difference it's just uh it's just to raise the bonnet and then the other one's going to sit obviously in where are we literally around about there which is there's just enough room to come up through there i don't think i can show you possibly i can let's have a look This is going to fit. Hang on, two seconds. Oops. Put it to the floor, why not? It's going to basically go along there. It'll sit around about there. Same position as the other one. I'll probably, I'll probably have to go more central with that one. Probably there, actually. Uh, obviously, it's going to come up slightly, but I, I can't feed it through at the moment. But it's going to sit there. The brackets for that are going to be quite easy to make, so that's on the floor. So it should be easier. To be honest, the front one is actually going to be easier now than the back one because uh, I have to do a lot more work to that than I expected, and also trying to do the design for it to get it right. So yeah, that's the pl that's what's happening so far. Um, oh, there's also a bracket on top of here. I didn't explain this. Uh, there's a bracket on top of here. Basically, that fits into the this section. Obviously, that moves up. That's the, that's the column that moves on the thread. This section here um, will be spaced out, so it'll be on like rubber spacers. Uh, and screws obviously into the bonnet. I don't want it too high because uh, the bonnet sits roughly, I think it's about here, roughly something like that. Um, so it'd be a nice base to sit basically, it's a nice cushioned landing almost for it, so there's no cracks and that sort of stuff come into play. So yeah, that's where I am at the moment. So the next time I do a video, we'll try and get some more done. Hopefully, maybe do this. I might even be able to do a test run next time, who knows? Uh, but I'll uh, crack on with that. Let me know what you think and. Uh, Subscribe and comment if you can.